A hail of tiles falls from a tall building, narrowly missing a person walking by. Taiwan is full of tiled buildings, and many of their facades have been shaken loose by the recent Hualien earthquake. But tiles falling from buildings is nothing new, and people sometimes get hit. In 2015, someone in Taipei was even killed. Most buildings with tiled facades are old, and as these buildings age, reports of tiles falling are on the rise. Heavily built-up New Taipei saw 102 reports of falling tiles in 2019. By 2023, that number had risen to 313. It's possible this trend will continue. Over 700,000 buildings in the city are over 30 years old. The average cost for fixing a damaged building is over 300,000 US dollars. And after each incident, neighborhood politicians hear the same question. Who pays? It's not just splitting the bill that's a problem. All occupants of a building also have to agree to do repairs in the first place. This means many building facades end up slowly falling apart. Laws might help to settle the issue, but there are not regular inspections of building facades. There's talk in the legislature of creating support and incentives for repairs to building facades, and for making the government responsible for carrying repairs out. But these remain ideas for now. The earthquake and the damage it's caused are a reminder that despite years of discussion, the appetite for action is limited. Eason Chen and John Van Trieste for Taiwan Plus.